love the harmonica. This is my um, second best instrument. Guitar is my first love. I love the harmonica. Saturday here, DJ Highlights. I'm in the recording studio here. Just trying out this new track that I'm working on. Just playing around here. This is a way to um, blow off some steam, making some music. Anybody want this track? Who wants this track? I'm going to make this track. Whoever wants it, let me know if you need some music for a podcast or whatever. I make music. So I'm going to make this track and store it away with the thousands and thousands of songs I have. Saturday to everyone out there.
love the harmonica. It's my favorite instrument. This is number two. My guitar is the, my first love. Harmonica is number two. I'm working on this music here, just for fun. If anybody needs some music, let me know. Let me know, I'll hook you up. I make music 24 seven.
like this track. I think I'm gonna keep it. Shout out to everybody out there. I'm just here trying out some new re uh, equipment that I have here. And um, got this track I'm working on. I was going to scrap it, but I'm going to keep it. I'm going to add some more things to it, of course. I'm going to play some live guitar on it. And um, I'm going to do a harmonica track. I'm going to record the track. And um, um, let me see what else. What else I hear? What else do I hear? Some real good claps. Some real good claps. Should I name this track? What should I name it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
put them. Um, all right, happy Saturday to everybody out there. Um, this is DJ Highlights. I'm here in my studio here, just blowing off some steam, making some music, trying out some new equipment, some new ideas. I have an album coming out, probably. Depending on what's going on in the next few months, I might release uh, a single and a video probably right before the summertime, or I might have to wait till next year. I want I want things to be up and running because I want to go out on the road as a DJ and uh, doing my poetry and performing some of my music. So I want to get out there, tour, join family again, having a good time with people out there. Hello to everybody out there that's watching. And um, this is one of my loves. You know, I uh, DJ, I cook, I make music.
All right, um, I'm gonna have to uh, go and um, set up my uh, guitar for a, a track here. I have to bring out the guitar here. You know, I might do something crazy. I might play the banjo. Can you believe the banjo? A little bit of plucking up in there with the banjo. You know what? I like to do things different. Let me let me reach over and get the banjo. Be right back. about playing the banjo. Let's see will this work. Let me try to get a nice little pluck on. Hey, let's see, let's see, let's see what's gonna work, what's gonna work, let's see, do we wanna go here? I might, be, I might put that on the track. I can see that. Yeah, I can see that. Can you see that? All right, y'all. Um, I'm going to sign out here. And um, I got to get everything set up for a live recording here. So I'm just playing around with some um, music here I have on my um, 
iPad. I'm actually coming from my iPad. I have some apps here that um, I can arrange music with. That's actually what I'm doing right now. This is actually coming from um, this music is actually coming from my iPad. actually coming from my iPad with this music. It's called Launchpad. And um, you can arrange music on here. And, um, and I have it going out to my 24 track recorder. And um, it's coming out two tracks left and right stereo. So you just, you can put one instrument at a time or you can come out multi instruments. Then you could, um, then you can plug in on 24 more tracks of guitar, vocals, whatever live instrument you know you want to come in on. So combining the um, iPad directly into this is called a Zoom recorder. It's a 24 track Zoom recorder, and it's really really nice. It's a standalone unit. You can I connect it to my my computer if I want to use it. What we call an interface, but as of right now, I'm using it, what we call a standalone. It's a standalone mode, and I'm so I know how to take different equipment and technology and make them work to make music. Um, I don't just use apps. I actually play. I play uh, my music as well. I play instruments. I play instruments. I'm not a, a app or a loop person. I actually, um, I believe in recording music. I've been making music for a long time, and um, it's what I do. It's one of the things I do. So, with this iPad, you can just tap, touch, whatever you know. It's all about touching a, a button here, how you can make music. This app is called Launchpad. I have it also on my, um, my uh, studio, my main recording studios over here. I have, it comes on the, um, it, it combines with your um, studios. And also you can use it on, um, uh, I don't know if it come on, um, Android or not, but I have it on my iPhones. I have it on all my computers. It's really nice. It's about, I have like 144 different um, creations of what kind of songs I want to make. Uh, for an example, I can stop this one. Let's go with something. Let's go with something new here. Let's come up with something brand new. What are we going to go with? Let's see. What is this right here? Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see what this one is. What is this going to be? Let's open. This is a whole new one here. I 
think. No. This is how simple and easy you can make a track. Right off the iPad, see how simple that is? You can just hit whatever you want to change it up. Remember, a launch pad if you want, if you have an iPhone or iPad or either your MacBook Pro or your iMac, it's called Launch Pad. And um, it's, it's really good. It's by Novation. Novation is the company. And um, if you um, buy the controller, well, where's my controller? I actually have a, um, a controller for this. Where is it? around here somewhere. Um, man, I got I got so much equipment everywhere. Where, oh, oh I have it out I have it in my other studio. But um it's a controller that controls it. I don't have to touch the iPad. There's a controller for it. And um, when you buy the controller you can download what they call the light version of course of the app you have to keep buying the sound pack, so I maxed it out. But they just uh, made it for a, um, you know, a reoccurring, uh, reoccurring. Um, I think it's like one ninety nine a month. You can use all the different sound packs. So that's the good thing about it. You know, if you're really making music and you're doing something with it, you know, it pays for itself. I combine live instruments. Sometimes I don't even use apps and all that stuff. I play live. True musician. I've been playing music. I, I was brought up making music when there was no computers and apps and phones and all that stuff. this truck right here so as you see I can make music 24 7 but um
This sounds like some theme music, you know? I can have some strings on here. I hear strings. Some strings, yes, that's what I hear. Wow. Yeah, I can... Man, I can go to the uh, synthesizer and play some live strings on here. I would add to this act, I would add strings and um, that's all I hear is strings. Funky, a funky bass line, a funky synthesizer type of a bass will go with this as well. I have a nice synthesizer over there. I can play some nice bass on that. You know that, that old school funk synthesizer? Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Yeah. Okay, two more tracks. Strings and some funky synthesizer bass. I just, um, I have a huge, huge uh, guitar collection. I just bought my uh, first bass guitar. I got it sitting over there. It's been sitting up for a couple weeks. It's still in the box. It has not even been cracked open. I got a uh, nice amp. I got the different pedals. I got everything a bass player um, a needs. And um, I haven't even cracked it open. It's been sitting, actually taking up space in my doorway. So I got to crack my bass guitar open and um, take some lessons. I'm going to take some online lessons from the Guitar Center and um, YouTube. You know, of course, you can go to YouTube and take some lessons. and. Uh, and I got a lot of great friends as musicians who can teach me how to play. So playing guitar, you know, it's a little bit different. You know, it's a little bit different, but I catch on fast because it's one of my desires. One thing about me, when I desire and want to do something, believe me, I do it. I have the attitude, I'm a bass player, and um, I never played bass in my life. So it's all about what you think and where you put yourself. So... I mean, being a guitarist, you know, bass is a whole different thing. So with my attitude, I'm a bass player. And I haven't even cracked my box open, you know. And, um, so I'm going to get to it real soon. I'm going to crack that stuff open. Y'all going to be seeing me playing the bass. I, I'm going to predict... You give me 30 days when I get some things off my plate, you give me 30 days and I'll be playing the bass guitar. I'm, not gonna, I'm just gonna dedicate my time to that and nothing else. I'm gonna play the bass guitar. I'm gonna take every lesson I can. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put probably six hours, six hours for 30 days. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna commit myself I, really soon. I'm gonna commit. Six hours for 30 days for me cutting open the box, taking the bass out, cleaning it up, getting it tuned up, and um, I'm going to play around with it on my own. I have a lot of different effects that I bought that I can um, actually, uh, you know, do a lot of funky different kind of stuff. Uh, my man right here, Boosie Collins. This is my favorite bass player right here. This man right here, Bootsy Collins. Um, I'm going to call Mr. Bootsy up and ask him for some advice. And, um, you know, he's a good guy. He would give me some advice. And um, 
So I'm gonna let him know he's my inspiration. When I was a kid, I used to play the my imaginary bass um, with the what a broom. I think I was just a broom and a mop <laughs> when I was first first getting into Boosie back in the day. Now, you know that was my space bass, but now I have my own bass and uh, I'm gonna learn how to play it. I'm gonna match it up. Trust me. Six hours, thirty days. I'll be a bassist. Yeah, I'm a fast learner because I have the desire. I'm going to put my mind, my heart, my soul to it. And um, you know, I taught myself how to play guitar, the harmonica, keyboards, how to record music, how to mix it. I teach myself everything. You know, I'm a writer. I'm a songwriter. I have a lot of songs that I've written. I have a probably... A few thousand, a few thousand songs recorded, and uh, all types of music. So I own a uh, record catalog of a uh, uh, well-known artist that I used to manage back in the day, and uh, so been in the business for a long time. There was times that I spent 10, 15 years ago, I remember spending three and four days in a recording studio, just recording music, mixing it and recording music. That's when it was tape, it was analog tape, making music right from the board, plugging instruments in, all the musicians come in and play play all those tracks, you mix, master it, put it out there. Now you can do everything at home. You know, not only with computers, believe it or not, you can make music on your iPhones. Actually, just for fun, I make music on my iPhones, on my iPad, on my 24 track standalone recorder here, to my different um, uh, computers, I have Macs, Android, so I'm surrounded, every room in here, even on the other side, there's a computer, I can play music, or I can DJ, so it was something that I was born to do, see, I know, I know my gifts from guys, I know my talents, and I, I was born to do music, so believe me, I, I, I got a lot of music that is already recorded. There's a lot of music inside of me, and um, I will be presenting, you know, music. A lot of music will be coming out. All right, before I sign out, I'm going to uh, spin this little, this little disco ball here for you guys. This is one of my uh, disco balls. Check this out. Ain't that nice? All right, this is for all the DJs out there. All the DJs have disco balls. All right, y'all. DJ highlights. I got to get uh, my act together here and plug in some um, live uh, instruments. All right, I got to plug in some instruments. Okay, peace and love to everybody out there. Continue to be inspired. Take care of yourselves. Take care of your family. When you go out, wear those masks, all right? Peace, love from DJ Highlights. I'm out for now. Check with y'all later. Peace. Gots to go.